After months of waiting and construction, the Colchester Causeway is open for the season. Local 22's Nick Anastasi now joins us live tonight from Colchester. Okay, we know that big rain came through about 45 minutes ago, but are people enjo enjoying it right now? Well, Lauren, it's kind of cleared out a little bit, but earlier today when I was here, it was packed with people coming out here to see the finished product. And everyone who I spoke with loved it and are happy to be back out here. After 10 long months of work, the Colchester Causeway is finally open for recreational use. The path closed down for repairs after Labor Day last year. The causeway was damaged in early May of 2018 after high surf eroded sections of the path. Parks and Recreation Director Glenn Katita says the opening wouldn't have been possible without some help from FEMA and the state. The town of Colchester is very proud of that resource that we have, but also being able to share it with uh, neighbors and visitors from all over the world even that come not necessarily this year but in the past so to have that resource open uh, and especially during these times where people are really valuing their outdoor recreation is just another place for people to go get outside and be active the 1.8 million dollar project was supposed to be completed for Memorial Day however some early winter weather and the pandemic caused that date to be pushed back to Labor Day Katita says the contractor expedited the work and was able to have the project completed five weeks early. Daniel Shibuk used to live near the causeway, but has since moved away. He was back out on the trail today to see the improvements made. Pretty smooth, pretty nice. Uh, I mean, there's still some bumps and stuff in it, but all in all, it's pretty good. Um, it's a big improvement from what it was last year and a couple of years ago. Now, Lauren, where I'm standing was not a part of the section that was repaired. It's about a half a mile up from where I am, a total of a mile into the trail. Live here in Colchester, Nick Anastasi, Local 22 News.